G'day folks, Wayne from Land Bay Fishing. Just chasing a few broom around pylons and the uh, the uh, boats around here. Up a creek today because of the wind, blowing 25 knots. When it's blowing this this much and you've got a small boat like mine, you, you can hit the creeks even in 30 knots. And you still get wind up here and it still is a bit harder to manoeuvre the boat, but it's not too bad. And certainly you don't go home without a feed. Although today we are, we're letting them go. All the brim are coming on the uh, motor oil, the, the two and a half inch slim swim. I've got a 128th ounce on here, Den's using a 1 16th. We're both catching fish, so with the 128th, I'm throwing it up in front of the boat, letting it drift down. It drifts really slowly with the current and drops probably, for a meter, it probably takes 12 to 15 seconds. Den's probably taking about six or seven seconds, and yet we're both catching fish, so it doesn't really matter. Hidden weights I like because you can't see anything other than the actual the fish or the slim swim. So get yourself some of these. Absolutely deadly on brim. Does that mean we're going to stay right here? Yeah, in this area. So just fish up near, near the top. Yeah, that's you watch what I do. So you flick, skim it across, just let it loft down. There's the first fish. That's it. Just lift the rod now. Leave the bit of line out. So can... <laughs> that was pretty awesome to see, wasn't it? Yeah, it was really cool. That's shitloads of them. That's bigger than that one. Dennis got a small one as well. The whole school came up. It's unbelievable to see. Probably about 10 or 12 and just absolutely smashed them right at the boat. Down there. Okay. Oh. Yep. Oh, yeah. no. oh, I dropped it. Okay. Oh, no, there we go. Ooh. Got it back. Yeah. I 
I've got a brim on here. Yep, I actually watched it come out and take the bait then. How good's that? Love sight fishing brim. It's not a bad fish, this one. Absolutely beautiful up here. You do get a bit of wind and it is a little bit harder to maneuver the boat, but it's not too bad. As I try not to crash. Yeah, we've uh, caught a couple of brim. We're uh, using the old Z-Man two and a half inch slim swims at the moment. They're just deadly up here. I don't know why they're so good, but it's all on this stuff. Z-Man slim swim two and a half inch on a hidden weight. Dennis is using 1 16th of an ounce and, uh, and I'm using probably 1 28th. A little bit of Procure. Seems to be absolutely doing the trick. And we've got three or four so far. Hopefully we'll get a few more. What to do when it's windy. So to give you an idea of what we're doing, when I get beside a boat like this, I'll take the uh, the motor, the electric motor off, throw it up to the front of the boat and it sinks down at a probably a meter every 15 seconds. So it's really slowly moving back underneath the boat. And I watch my line for a tick and I got a tick then and I missed it. There's a tick. And I'm on. Oh, I need a little one. Oh, I don't care. Oh no, it's not as big as the one I got. Yep, right on the top. And there's one with it too, throw right where that was. They're right up the back then. Right. Yep, in the shade, cool. Yeah, what's that? Well, 
folks that's it for us um caught a few fish today hope you enjoyed the video if you did hit the like button for us subscribe to the channel and i'll catch you on the next video thanks for watching